Great people, great people of Biafra, freedom fighters, lovers of freedom, my great people. Welcome to IPOB Rapture Media under the leadership of Mazin Namdekano. Now, as you are listening to me, I want you to pay attention to this post, the picture that I have next to my video right now. Both of them are Mazin Namdekano. There is no doubt about it. But I something I want to tell my people, because I want to set the record straight. They can never set agenda for us to follow. We will always set agenda for them. But now pay attention. Because I'm coming to debunk every lie they are been telling our people. There is a false narrative that some people want to push. There is a propaganda that these people want to push. But we are bigger than them. We have come to challenge anybody that stands on our way. On our way. Now, I want you people to always pay attention to this page and be careful and be warned to that page. You know, our people so much love gossip. This page, you should be careful about this page that I'm going to call now. I don't want to break out his video where he was talking nonsense and uh, vomiting all kind of evil from his mouth. I want us to be careful about page called Biafra Unite slash channel television there is a very these people are concocting story every day these people are fabricating lies every day and i want to prove it beyond reasonable doubt that zuko nigeria are working with autopilot if you don't understand it today that is not how you can ever get it now pay attention and listen in details because i'm coming with details according to Brian united slash channel television he said the man that Soludo visited was not our lead Onyendu. He was asking who gave Mazen Nam the clothes that, uh, clothe that he, he won that day that Soludo visited him. Now, I want you people to understand. No, Soludo could have visited Mazen Nam the Kanu wearing only pants. That is what they are expecting. They are Mazen, so they say that, Ma, they, they are, you know, there is some lies there is some allegation that this guy was laying against our legal team. And there is never, there is never any time our legal, our legal teams come out or came out, begin to tell us that Mazen Namdekanon don't have any other clothes. What they have been telling us is like they want to, they never allow Mazen Namdekanon to change clothes in coming to the court. Because the clothes that Mazen Nam the Kanu demanded for him to wear, he demanded for people to give him was Isiago. And the Zuko Nigeria denied Mazen Nam the Kanu wearing Isiago. There is no ever, there is never our legal team said that Mazen Nam the Kanu don't have any other clothes. They only said they are denying Mazen Nam the Kanu changing clothes. For the court case, which the clothes that Mazen Namdekano demanded was Isiago, but they denied him wearing Isiago. See, there is something that I want our people to understand. I want you people to understand this because if I don't explain, that is why I'm here to debunk every lie that these people have already concocted and fabricated. I am here to debunk it and set the record straight because our people so much love gossip. This guy, Biafran United Slash Channel Television, are now telling you people that the zoo have now vindicated him. Now I want you people to pay attention very well and listen because I'm going to prove it beyond reasonable doubt that autopiloters are working with the zoo called Nigeria. Now listen. I want you people to understand that this guy was saying a lot of things. He said Mazen Namdekano is a Liverpool fan. This thing is before the court. Before the court. The court. After the visitation of Soludo to our lead Onyendu. The guy came out to begin to make a broadcast. To push a narrative that the man that Soludo visited was a mask wearer. He wasn't our leader. Because if you people haven't forgotten, remember there is a time that these people were saying that if Mazen Nam, they cannot come out today and condemn autopilot, that they will 
attack mass in Namdekan. I want you people to remember that because we are here with our learned people. We are here to tell you people how it is without mixing anything at all. That is what they said. If Mazin Namdekano come out and condemn autopilot, they will attack Mazin Namdekano. Now, listen to the narrative they want to push. They want to begin to tell you in advance to be in case if Mazin Namdekano come out tomorrow because they know that Mazin Namdekano is going to condemn them. If Mazin Namdekano don't have to tell them something, but by going back to his family, then you will know that Mazin Namdekano does not belong to them. Now they are now beginning to push the narrative that the man that Soludo visited was a mask wearer. Begin to ask about the clothes that Mazin Namdekano won. Now I want you people to pay attention. Mazin Namdekano being a Liverpool fan doesn't mean that he cannot wear another clothes. Mazin Namdekano told us in many of his broadcasts that most clothes that he's wearing is people is a gift from people being Mazin Namdekan a Liverpool fan and somebody brought a gift of to give Mazin Namdekan with that Atlantic Madrid uh, clothes so do you telling me that Mazin Namdekan will not accept it because he's a Liverpool fan now begin to reason my people begin to reason only the problem now why they are calling Mazin Namdekan a mask wearer because Mazin Namdekan wear Atlantic Madrid clothes now my question is this now i want you people to know that this is a narrative they want to push this guy biafran united slash channel television said this thing before the court of yesterday in abuja and do you know what really happened yesterday for the narrative to push do you know that bintan yaku also asked Marcin nandekanu yesterday I thought that you are a Liverpool fan. Mazen Nandekano reply, my lord, yes, I am a Liverpool fan. They stop it there. They have already taken that word. That is why this guy came out yesterday and begin to say that the zoo called Nigeria have vindicated him. That is a narrative they want to push. Now, let me ask you people a question. What a cloth that Mazin Namdekanu wear has to do with the case of Mazin Namdekanu. Mazin Namdekanu being a Liverpool fan, what did he have to do with the case of Mazin Namdekanu? What did that have to do? A common cloth, but because they want to push a narrative. Now, the guy was claiming a laying allegation on our legal team that they have set time with that number that they don't allow Mazin Namdekanu to change clothes. Like I said, Mazen Nam can have other clues. But what they are denying Mazen Nam can is that they will never allow him to wear Isiago in the court. So now let me just put it this way. The clothes that our leader wear yesterday was a, was a Fendi, right? And it's a white Fendi. Now, since the adoption of our leader, if these people are claiming that Mazen Nam cannot don't have another clothes, Mazin Namdekano have adopted now going to almost going to one year. So does it mean that if Mazin Namdekano is wearing only this Fendi and God so good, the Fendi is a white, not black. So now use your sense. If Mazin Namdekano have only Fendi, that white, he's sleeping with it and waking up with it. He will take shower and wake up with it. If you want to wash it, so Mazin Nandekan will wear only pants if they wash the clothes. And look at the clothes, the Fendi. Since the day one that Mazin Nandekan have been using that clothes to come to the court, the clothes is still shining. He's still clean, like they just bought it. If Mazin Nandekan don't have another clothes, don't you people know that that Fendi that is white could have turned to another color by today? It could have turned to brown. If it's only clothes that Mazen Namdekano have in DSS dungeon, the Fendi today could have turned to brown, not white anymore, according to these people, because they are saying that the legal team said they, they don't allow Mazen Namdekano. But I'm telling you people, what they don't allow Mazen Namdekano is that Mazen Namdekano can never wear Isiago in the court.
that the Muslim now becoming decided he's going to be wearing only Fendi. That is why you see that Fendi after the court, Muslim now becoming will take over the Fendi and wear different clothes. And I want you people to understand since our legal teams. The family of Mazin Namikano have been visiting Mazin Namikano. There is nobody ever show us any video. They keep on visiting Mazin Namikano two times in a week. Nobody ever show us video. How did these people know that Mazin Namikano is not changing clothes? You remember that all Jews or Carlo visited our leader. They did not show us any video. What they, they did not show us any picture. What they show us is only the article. Do you know the clothes that our leader won? The day that he met Ojo Zokalo, let us begin to reason. Don't let people brainwash you. Like what I'm trying to tell you, what really happened yesterday was not coincident. It wasn't coincident. It's just a plan walk. Come out and begin to push this narrative that the man that Soludo visited was an, a, a mask wearer. So that tomorrow when they will release our leader Onyendu, people will begin to doubt if this man is a real Onyendu. That is the narrative. And yesterday, Bintanyako vindicated them so that the narrative will keep on going. And the guy came out also yesterday or today to make a new video, begin to tell the people that they have already vindicated him. Of course, they want to push a narrative to gullible people, but we are here to debunk them. Mazin Namdekano, Soludo visited Mazin Namdekano because that was not the first day. Soludo have visited Mazen Namikano in 2016 in Kuje prison when Soludo leads some Igbo groups and to go and visit Mazen Namikano. So that was not a new, uh, a new thing. But one thing I want you people to understand that our leader Mazen Namikano have different clothes in the prison. He changed clothes. That Fendi that you saw yesterday our leader wear was not only clothes that he had. If it's only that Fendi, by today that Fendi could have turned to brown. Use that as a sense. Understand that. That is a narrative. And I hope every one of us understands all this my explanation. For some of you that are going to Biafra United Class Channel Television, you people are just going there to listen to lie. Of course, on me here, the guy in me here, masquerade. We know that he's living in South Africa. The guy is living in South Africa. Very soon I will tell you people where, where he stays, where he lived, where the address. Because you see us, we are telling people the way it is. You cannot come in here and begin to deceive our people. That to show you that autopiloters, they are working with the zoo. Don't listen to them. They are coming to deceive. Great people, good day and welcome.